Uh, we've been really enjoying the tour so far. Um, yeah, we've got to come to some places that we've never been before, like Budapest. Um, although some of us have been here before, but not to play. Um, yeah, we don't have a, we haven't had a lot of time to uh, rest. I think we've had like about three days off, and we've been out in a fair few places, so it can be quite tiring. But yeah, we always enjoy going out in a new place. So, so yeah, we've had a great time on this tour so far. Uh, I think we prefer doing like kind of our own concerts, although the placebo tour was a really fun experience because we got to play on such big, like in big arenas, so and to play really loud, so it was, it was fun, yeah. So we like them both, but yeah, it's nice to be coming and playing um, smaller, kind of dingier places, you know. We had some time off in between. We usually tend to write in London at our own houses, um, make demos and stuff around our house. So um, yeah, we just we kind of had six months where we were sort of on and off playing out uh, sort of one-off gigs and stuff and small tours but yeah we managed to find time to do quite a lot of writing and hanging out and um, sort of experimenting and stuff. Yeah. We found the time and we like kind of the idea of working quite quickly as well so when we had the songs we went into the studio as soon as we had some a chance to do it really and, and it just it felt right to do to do that then you know so so, with that, so we did it. <laughs> I think we wanted it, um, well we wanted to, to be, yeah, we wanted to wash people's brains basically. <laughs> I think it was like we, like the effect of something constantly zooming in, so you're kind of starting at one point when you zoom in and then, uh, yeah, it was like that kind of effect, I think it um, goes with the, the music, that kind of like forward motion and like zooming in and look nice. <laughs> Well, right now we were listening about ten minutes ago to the Suspiria soundtrack for the horror film Suspiria. That's by cool. Goblin. It's by a guy called Goblin. And uh, right now, about ten minutes ago, we were listening to Curtis Mayfield as well. He's pretty cool. We're always listening to something that's kind of we always sit around like listening to music, and it's kind of what we enjoy doing the most. So it's always something different going on. But, um, we were listening to the garden. Third Silver Raffles album earlier. Yeah. Outside in the sun, that was really nice. Yeah, all, all kinds of stuff, really. Yeah. We've yeah. been on tour as well with our friends, um, it's a band called Young Husband. Um, uh, they just finished um, when we back home, but their, their new album we've been listening to quite a lot as well. Really good. Yeah. And they're to Deer Yeah. Lots yeah, of stuff. We've been trying to listen to as many different things as possible, really. Yeah, lots of stuff. It's one of the things about touring is because you have a huge amount of time in the band, uh, like 10 hour drives and stuff. So, um, yeah, we just listen to as many different things as we can get our hands on. My name, uh, Panda, came from Tom when we were young because we've known each other since we were little kids, um, basically giving me the nickname. Uh, maybe just because I looked like a baby panda, I don't know. <laughs> But it just kind of stuck, and um, it seemed to fit at the time. Yeah, now now I kind of realise that I have to explain it to a lot of people. <laughs> it wasn't such a good idea. <laughs> oh, I heard about Zigat. Apparently, it's amazing. It's like uh, apparently it's like uh, someone said it was like uh, Glastonbury a little bit. But yeah, we'd really like to come. We'd like to come and play if we can, but we haven't been asked yet, as far as I, as far as I know. <laughs> Hi, we're Toy, and you're watching Carrot Blog.